More than 6 million people have been fully vaccinated against COVID-19 in Virginia. That's according to the Department of Health. The shot has been available for the last year and a half, but as subvariants emerge and case numbers keep rising, you might be wondering how effective your vaccine and boosters might be. Our Leland Pinder spoke to health leaders about what could come next. CBS News reports COVID-19 infections are on the rise in at least 40 states, and that includes Virginia, the highly transmissible BA5 Omicron subvariant dominating the surge. Dr. Brooke Rossheim with the Department of Health says it's important to monitor CDC data on spread in your area. There's a lot of COVID in Virginia. This map shows community levels categorized. Green is low, yellow is medium, and orange is high. In central Virginia, with only a few exceptions, you can see transmission is high. If you've been vaccinated, Rossheim says those shots are still effective as BA5 continues to surge. It's not that the vaccines are not any good anymore. It's the fact that SARS-CoV-2 has changed. The vaccines we have now while they are not as great as we would like in terms of preventing infection, they are very good in terms of preventing severe outcomes. And that includes hospitalization, ICU admission, or even death. Rossheim says if you're eligible, get your booster shot. Those 18 to 49 with normal immune systems are eligible for one. Those 50 and up are eligible for two. If you've gotten the primary series, then you are considered to be fully vaccinated. You've gotten the primary series and all the booster shots that you are eligible for. You are then considered to be up to date. We want everybody to be up to date. Right now, BA5 is the most common variant in the U.S. Rossheim says sometime this fall or winter, experts expect a new vaccine becoming available that specifically targets Omicron. That has the potential to be a big, big deal. And you'll soon have another option for vaccination in the coming weeks, according to the CDC. Tuesday, final regulatory approval was given for the Novavax vaccine. It's been used in other countries, but would be new here in the United States. Officials hope those who have still not been vaccinated will consider this as an alternative to Pfizer, Moderna, or Johnson & Johnson. It's for those 18 and older with two doses taken 18 or excuse me, 28 days apart. 